Go ahead, Ed. Another on vaccines. Does the president have any comment on the first group of service members who have been discharged for refusing to get the COVID vaccine? So I know um, I'd, of course, refer you overall to the Department of Defense. My understanding is that 99 percent of the Air Force is in compliance. So we're talking about uh, less than 1 percent, um, which to us, the story is that it's more than 99 percent who are, are in compliance. Uh, I would also note, and they can give you more detail on this, but this is at the end of months of counseling and engagement with those not yet in compliance about what is required here. And of course, there were people who were granted exemptions, uh, who applied for those and granted exemptions. Uh, as the Secretary of Defense said, the requirement will help ensure readiness, which is what the American people expect from their armed forces, and we're certainly encouraged by the high level of compliance from the Department.